What are you doing? Wow! <laughs> Nothing stops people here. how I want to feel is just an uncorrupted place where people really can do what they want and, and more. If people, if they have time and space to function, to do whatever they want to do. They're going to start doing what they love to do and what they're good at anyways. There's no authority necessary to, to make things happen. Things will happen out spontaneously. I think this is yeah, very important and, uh, well, it's being threatened by uh, authorities. They want to shut it down and turn this into a ship uh, factory. Uh, of course, we think this is a, a really bad idea because this is much more interesting because there's industry all around Amsterdam, but there's no place like Adem. This place, it was a shipyard where a lot of working class people built ships. And it went bankrupt, and then it was the first squatting crew that took it, with creative people. They started recording music, and, uh, painting, artists. They were kind of squatters, but never really like within the squat movement, who were still active at that time. Then they got evicted, they give cookies and coffee to the police that came and kicked them out. Then they were going to build lots of stuff here and uh, develop the area, but instead they sold it to the Mafia, who kept it empty. And uh, so it got squatted again by a beautiful wooden boat, the Papillon, which is now uh, upside down. Slowly uh, a whole village started to exist with trees and rare animals and uh, people living in wagons, boats and in the buildings. This was all 18 years ago that the Papillon landed and uh, that was the time that I arrived as well. The whole world's meant to be a giant playground, believe it or not. It's not meant to be a giant business park. And we need a big, big playground. So what happened to you? They built for us, especially this huge ass building warehouse where we can play and create and make. We're creative people. We, we don't like artists, we only like creative people. And that's why we're doing this stage here which is uh, a sort of a, a drum and bass from fire. These gas bottles here, these are how we do our music. These are flamethrowers. A nice visual, but the point of the fire is the sound. And we create rhythms with uh, the different sounds of the fire and explosion.
This here is our bass instrument. Fire inside the tubes, and depending on the different length of the tube, you get a different bass tone. And then my instrument is here. This is a bowed instrument. <laughs> burn it and then, then and then it's finished every time there's blood sweat and emotions yeah people feel that man you know what i mean from small children old people lovers but the figurine itself is a masculine man figure wearing a mask pointing to the sky and holding a ship it turns into a fire, one of the elements. Powerful. The, the fire is the energy of sun in the earth. And so I like purpose fire. For have something more, I built this pendulum. And this pendulum gonna swing with the energy of fire, propel it of steam. And when uh, the water will hot and there is steam pressure inside, the pendulum starts to swing. It's nice to stay around the fire and take chill out, think about. The pendulum, I call it a DNA of time, organic uh, vision of time, no? The time is rhythm. Uh, we ignore the clock, but the, but the clock is an invention. The time is just, is just rhythm. It's the night and the day. It's the rhythm of the season, it's the rhythm of our, um, it's the rhythm of our life. Yeah. And ADM represents to me a place where the hands of the clock don't stick in your ass. There's no time here and I don't think people, uh, of, of course there's history between people, but I think there's a big thing in common. ADM and our ADM. The freedom of the mind and Everybody's pretty free. free and Do whatever you want, whenever you want. Free and very, well, very open is quite limited today. Like just pretty, um, yeah, and restricted. People live by the rules. People are all victims of the rules they live by. I feel people here don't have these rules so much or are way more comfortable bending them, bending all these rules, and that's how it how he rolls. And like modern society, modern culture has totally lost it. And what you've got here is a bit of, like it, to me it's a paradise. We're building the kids' area and we try to make it colourful, magic and attractive and still our theme is about the forgotten and lost uh, fairy beings uh, we never see anymore in town but they all uh, are here. So with the kids we're gonna make a trek to the ADM to find the beings which are nature spirits. Enjoy your fantasies and keep on dreaming! So uh, this is the uh, Mazda when uh, we built for the festival this year. It's work well at all. And then we have this uh, big uh, like uh, flame machine to scare the people with. So we build it from uh, only from garbage we pick uh, there and then 
and the goal is to recycling some garbage to make like better garbage from it and because i work with garbage i say you cannot really get rid of it no yeah, just to use it not avoid it you cannot hide it you cannot put it on the ground you cannot burn it just use it understand it use it dismount it minimalize revitalize into something else it comes from somewhere it can go somewhere else It's a big hand who crushes pallets or campers or caravans or whatever you have extra. And we got shit loads of that stuff. All the sculptures you're gonna see here, they are here permanent, they're not part of the party. They are made by various artists who like to do all recycle art. And we even have our own brewery. <laughs> Making beer tomorrow on the festival. Live. Because after you take and you take and you take, you also have to give at a certain point. And then you might as well give in a very colorful and nice place. Cool. <laughs> oh! It's a magic, it's a magic, it's a magic. I live close by, so it's uh, it's my neighbors. Hey, very happy neighbors, very good neighbors, yes. Don't know what more to say in that sense. Why are you whoa, 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 wow, that's lovely. So this ship, for us it represents a lot. It was the ship which came here with the squatters when this was empty to take this place and build it into what it is now. Unfortunately, it sank last year. We transformed the boat in um, a drone. So we put the propeller on the top. Seven of these spaceships flying around in the whole universe. This one landed here, had a little bit of problems, but maybe next year it will leave us again and take off. Into space. <laughs> And so Le Papillon will be a room bar uh, for the festival. The control room. Yeah. So this is the control room of the spaceship. We got everything. This is a Tesla coil. It's like mad science. It makes about 11,000 volts and then goes through the ballast. Uh, which, which makes, uh, which double the voltage. And this goes to the capacitors. This is actually quite a lot. Ele Electromagnetic uh, poles go through the secondary coil and then it goes up into the turret. Then the, the charge coming out of it is one and a half million volts. And then you get lightning. But here you've got lots of um, different fronts on which people are working and that is inspiring on a daily basis. Like, like what brought us together is rather the possibilities of the place than the common goal, which is beautiful because it gives you a variety of people. We are all only busy with hobby. People are just uh, busy with uh, things that they would really like to do and they want to do it. Alrighty, well, welcome to the ADM. We got a port here and we took some fish out of the water and now you can see the ship of fools and they are right there. These people came sailing from all over the big seas to come especially here for us. In this, this is the ship of fools, which is a theater company. We just came back after a travel of 10 years back to Amsterdam. The ship is 100 years old. Being their colleagues of the ADM, 
we came back here because uh, they, uh, it's a benefit party and uh, we are uh, contributing to their party. Uh, we want them to stay here because it's important they are here. They are creating a free republic. We are having a free republic. We just come to see our friendly state. We visit our it's a diplomatic visit. Welcome on the ship of fools! This is our living and working place. Yeah. Salut! And you go straight to the costume room, which is one of the most important part of our theatre. We are a group of actors, directors, musicians and costume designers. Our work here is to bring the illusion to the people everywhere we go that another life, another world is possible. We're gonna do cabaret tomorrow night on Friday. Special edition for the birthday of Edia. Cabaret? Hello? <laughs> real, real expression, you want? Without the salt or folly, every meal is tasteless. But like normal. And uh, man, and tell you, it is police clothes, yeah? I think every police agent is a little bit homo. Like this. Yeah. Like, homo is <laughs> How beautiful it is! This is Netco Tide. Enjoy yourself. And you will find freedom. Let's fly. Degree of craziness. Well, uh, they are all artists, you know. Like, so how crazy can be art? As crazy as you can imagine, of course. You know, so that's what is happening here as well. <laughs> Well, it was our birthday party, eh? Right? Ja mala mamika, ja mama malika, stay hold the weekend.
We, we like having people here because it shows off what we do. It shows off our culture, shows off solo wind power, shows off our musicians, our poets, our artists, our robot makers. So it's, it's all good for us. Secret Alter Ego 5DM. Hmm. The hypocrite us. Why the fire? What is it uh, in the people that drives them that drives them to fire? Our uh, instant uh, TV. One trend that always stays, you know, like forever. Because it's something like. Evolution, the very huge step was made when people or uh, Homo sapiens at that time learn how to make uh, fire himself. That was like a big move. We have a, we have a tank with uh, used oil. Used oil uh, goes to combustion chamber, which is uh, red hot glowing. There it evaporates and uh, ignites. There is uh, another iron uh, cup where you melt aluminum. The fire is uh, conducted to a uh, foundry. Then you can pick it up easily and uh, pour it somewhere. And we made a, no a lovely flag. The message, Adian Blyft, which means Adian stays. And that one goes out to everyone. It's Adian Blyft. And that's what it's going to do. Um, obviously, the government are trying to evict us, or, or, or the private owners trying to evict us. We're not really sure which it is. Well, it's really clear that this is about speculation. Like ownership rules, laws, uh, and there's a game to. Uh, figure out how they're going to be able to evict a community which is already, you know, in harmony here, peaceful and hanging out and not, that's important too. Yes, I think we're making something more sustainable, there's all this other stuff here. This is all based on like systems, instructions, which are 
Coffee crumble at some point and are mostly not really based on people. Nice. We're interested in a global sustainable culture and uh, hopefully we're part of reminding them that, that is actually possible. Um, there's just amazing art happening all over the place and that's why places like this are important. So yeah, we're, we're probably stay for as long as, as we want to really. Also in, in, in Europe there's uh, indigenous people that are being fucked by uh, our megalomaniac uh, Western society. You know, it's our right to be here because we are the indigenous people of Amsterdam. Leave us alone. Extra peace.